Hi, Rob here from the team at Visible Body. Here's a tip to get your students learning by dissecting circulatory anatomy in Human Anatomy Atlas for Z-Space. The Z-Space Activities Library includes an activity called Investigating the Circulatory System. Teachers will have this guide and students will have this worksheet. The goal of this lesson is for students to understand the functions of the circulatory system. Before students dive into the lesson, use Atlas on Z-Space to give a quick introduction to how deoxygenated blood comes into the heart and passes to the lungs, and how oxygenated blood comes from the lungs into the heart and out to the body. Launch Human Anatomy Atlas. Under the main menu, access the circulatory system views and launch the heart section tile. A quick tip to get a cleaner view of the heart is to select one of the coronary vessels. Use the breadcrumb trail to select all of them and then hide. Now that you have a clear view of the heart's four chambers and valves, you're ready to walk students through a step-by-step -step review process of how the organ pumps blood. Show how the blood enters the right atrium from the superior and inferior vena cava. Rotate the model so that it shows those structures. I like using the draw tool for this. Note that the draw tool locks the screen so you can draw. And point out to students that deoxygenated blood travels from the superior and inferior vena cavus into the right atrium. Release the draw tool and move to an anterior view of the heart. Now use the draw tool again to show students the path blood travels from the right atrium through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle and then out through the pulmonary valve to the pulmonary artery and to the lungs. You can apply the same method to explain blood flow from the lungs through the left side of the heart, out through the aorta, and to the body tissues. Now your students are ready to complete the circulatory system worksheet. Assign each group of students to use the draw and notes feature to save four pictures, one for each section of the worksheet. Thanks for listening.